The second assessment task that you will face in services marketing this semester is the group project. The purpose of the group project is to build on the skill sets that you used for the take home exam. So the exam gave you an opportunity to use a set of theoretical frameworks, ideas and written technique which now are being revisited and expanded upon in the group project. Now, the things to understand about the group project. Priority one, the group consists of between one and six people. You are responsible for your own team selection, for your own group selection. So if you don't find anybody, you're soloing. If you don't want to work with anybody, you're also soloing. If you want to team up, we have a range of channels and opportunities for people to meet each other up to and including the lecture. Once you have selected whether you are playing solo or in a group, what you are being asked to do is to deliver a 2000 word essay no later than week nine. And it's the Tuesday 9am, so you've got the public holiday to your advantage. And it's a choice of one of the following two topics. Topic A, critique an existing services product and use theory to explain what is it doing right, what it can do better, and any areas for innovative development. You must justify your positive and negative evaluations with the use of theory. Now, a critique is a, is not a criticism, it is an assessment. A critique should be able to showcase the positives of a service. What is going right? What is it doing right? What is the theory that is being used and how is it using it well? You may also find opportunities to talk to additional elements of things that could be improved, things that could be better. Fundamentally, you're being asked to evaluate positively and negatively. The consequence of which is if you only come in with a critique that talks the negative of what the service is doing wrong, you've missed the opportunity for the maximum number of marks. Your alternative topic, topic B, is to propose a new services marketing offering based on the personal and or professional skills of your group. If you are a solo player, you can still do this task. You are still a group of one. The idea here is to look at yourself and your teammates and say, what is it that we have as a set of skills that we can offer to the marketplace? You would then take this offering, explain, how it meets the market demand. So you're looking here at what can we offer that has a demand in the market. So there has to be a realism, there has to be a obvious target market for you to be addressing with your skill set. And then how using the tactical services marketing mix, the seven P's of marketing, will you meet that market demand with your service offering? So this is going to require you to have a bit of an audit of yourself, a bit of an understanding about what it is you and your team can offer, how you're going to explain it in a services marketing perspective, what is the product, how you're going to price it, what's your promotion channels, what's your distribution, what physical evidence will be necessary, what are the people involved, both yourselves as providers and customers you're targeting, and what are the processes that you'll need to put into place to make this work? So your two choices here. One is to go down the innovation uh, entrepreneurship path and prepare a services marketing offering based on you and your group. The other is to go down the evaluate and review path and critique a services product based on what is already out there. They are alternate directions. You cannot do both tasks in the same assignment. So you need to pick a side and stick with it.